I'm Michael Goulian, and I first soloed an airplane before I could drive a car. I've been lucky enough to fly air shows all around North America, and I've raced in the Red Bull Air Race World Championship around the globe. My wife and I also own and operate Mike Goulian Aviation, a Cirrus training center based in Plymouth, Massachusetts, near beautiful Cape Cod. So subscribe to our channel and come along for a journey of passion, dedication, and excellence as I bring you behind the scenes and inside the cockpit of some of the most amazing airplanes and air shows in the world. You can also follow my wife Karen's journey to get her instrument rating in our beautiful Cirrus SR22. Okay, here we go on Karen's IFR lesson number two. We're again going to keep working on the attitude instrument flying that we did in the first lesson. And then we're going to introduce sort of some turns and then some steep turns, see how she does on that. A uh, little funny story on steep turns when she was a private pilot that maybe you'll learn about in the airplane that I'll tell. And then last but not least, we'll do some unusual attitudes. I think I can probably get out of them pretty well. Not so sure about Karen especially under the hood, but we'll see how she does. Should be a lot of fun. Let's give it a try. Automated weather observation two one two seven Zulu. Wind one one zero at zero niner. Visibility one zero. Sky condition clear. Got the AWAS. Got the Got the A was. A was. I got my uh. Okay, gang. So we're gonna taxi to runway one five at Plymouth today. And uh, there's a ton of traffic you can probably hear on the Unicom, 990, like that. And uh, it's fun, airplane taking off, airplane landing. It's kind of like uh, JFK here today, Plymouth International. But it's, uh, it's pretty nice. That's what kind of makes Plymouth pretty cool. And uh, see how... taking advantage of a beautiful yeah, day. Yeah, it's a beautiful day in Plymouth. It's been foggy every morning, so this has been this is kind of cool. And... Um, you know, we, we got a lot of comments on our first YouTube video, so thanks a lot. But a lot of them were like, how are you teaching your wife how to fly? And uh, one of my best buddies, Dennis Dunbar, is like, Mikey G, that's never going to end well. And I'm like, no, no, it'll be just great. So, Karen, you still love me? Love you. Yeah, at least for today. Cirrus 199 Mike Golf crossing runway 624 at Kilo on the ground. Oh, man. You're doing so good. All of my yelling at you has been really great because you're oh, like, yeah? I almost don't need you. You don't need me anymore. That's not true. That's pretty darn good. I'm just waiting until my landing. Like a pro. Uh-uh. Yeah, that's true. You're, you don't need me until it comes time to land. Like, Mikey and G, you got it. Yeah. That's why you're a co-pilot. Yeah, right, thanks. I'm actually baggage. Just give way to that dude there. Yeah, I am. Indicated. Uniform, downwind one five. That's my CIV acronym. Hoorah. I'm a CIV, so it's selected, indicated, verified. You're a CIV, all right. <laughs> uh, okay, flight instruments. Still zero okay. one nine, zero one nine, attitude and turn. Yeah, I, again, I go around the horn, right? Yeah. So the airspeed zero, the zero. attitude's erect, okay. 140 feet once. 40 feet so twice, and uniform, there's no nav flag, so we're going to go direct profit, right? right. Got it. Got so, it. again, I'll act like the controller. I've got the radios. You just fly the airplane nice and uh, smoothly, okay? Okay. Okay, and I'll turn that down for you. Okay, all right. Move up and hold. Jump. Okay. Clear and right. I think 
that's John in there doing touch and go, so okay. you can take the runway. So, boost pump, mixture, flaps, lights, and switches. Okay. Plymouth traffic, Cirrus 199, Mike Golf, we're taking the active runway 15 at Plymouth to depart. We'll be a right turn. 199, Mike Golf, departing runway 15, Plymouth. Plymouth traffic, that's about 4 Bravo Fox, up up on about a 4 mile left 45, 15, Plymouth. Get that nose up. Like that, nice. Okay. That's beautiful. And then it just... See how much right rudder you need, though? Yeah. Hold that rudder. Hold the right rudder. Hold the right rudder. Put the airplane into the command bars, please. I've got John in sight. Don't yeah, worry. Sight. Okay. 90 knots. 90 knots. Nice. He's turning. No vector. Okay. All right, from the traffic, uh, Cessna 249, turn the crosswind. One five Plymouth for left coast down the road, there's a four five one five. See that? It turned automatically. Traffic, four five one five. Run about a one mile uh, forty five. I'm looking for you. Ten o'clock. No problem. Zero miles. Okay. Two four nine. Uh, Cirrus. One nine nine. Michael. Nine o'clock. Turn right, heading two eight zero. Clear on the right. Two eight zero. I'm Michael. Yeah, that's, that's harder when you can't see what you're doing out the window. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's the whole idea, Jack. Oh, yeah? I should have played video games as a little kid. Yeah, Never me too. Did. 2257 and 2000. All right. We're gonna get back over the bay. Okay. And then we're gonna do a right 360 the, uh, degree the turn with right? 30 <laughs> degrees of bank. And then and if you're doing delta really delta well, we'll five, do five, 45 one, two, degrees negative, of bank. Uh, two four is not gonna work. Okay, so 30 degrees. Delay for one five. Here, first, first we're gonna do 360 going. Right or left? Zero, we, whichever way you'd like. Let's start to the right, and then we'll transition to the left. To so we'll do a right 360, a left 360, and, uh, and left at 30 degrees of bank, 4,500 feet. Okay. 16, 600 Yankee fly, heading a zero, uh, 4 zero vectors for... Uh, okay, you good? Sequence. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Jetty, I, mean, I don't need to Clear on the right. I don't nope, need to give you're just power, great. Nope. Jetty, 20, you have the field in sight. Airport in sight for Gamma Jet 820. Approach, uh, Airport, nice, so you'll need a little bit of the, uh, back pressure or some trim, whatever you want to use. Yeah. Roger, thanks. Really good. Contact, uh, approach really, good. really good. Wee! Wee! Guys, it's a two-story. Karen was learning how to fly. She was afraid of steep turns. So I took her out in an airplane, showed her steep turns and made her cry. That is a true story. That was it, a long time ago. Doesn't matter. She still cried. Yes, I made my wife cry in a plane. Sorry, I'm a terrible human being. Through 180. Right? Yep. I'm not doing very good on my altitude. You're doing fine, just smoothly lower the nose. Get it just out, just a hair. Don't make a huge correction, it's only 100 feet off, right? Right. Gamma Jet 820, cancel IFR. And uh, Gamma Jet 820, IFR cancellation received. Thanks. Gamma Jet 820, you can change the flight. Okay, where's your flight path marker? It's above the white horizon line. Yeah. 250, a 7 Boston approach, maintain 2000, and uh, say your next request. Great, you're doing great. I like it. Yeah. 45 to go. Roll it out. Easy there, Speedy. Nose let down. Where's the green flight path marker? Okay, really good. For you right now. Turn left, heading up 330. Okay, get the airplane trimmed up. Alright, now you're going to do a steep turn to the right. 
November 0, 9 or Yankee, descend and maintain 4,000. Okay, so okay. steep turn, 45, 45 degrees, degrees turn. of bank. Now, we have to disconnect the electronic stability protection, which I'll do by holding the red button for you, okay? Okay. Make sure, why don't you get to 4,500 for me? 9 or Yankee, reaching 4,000, turn right, heading 0, 6, 0. Like now, normally we would do this as part of the Cirrus IFOM at a slower Project speed, but since we're still breaking in the engine, 5, we're just going to do it at a normal cruise speed, okay? Okay. But you're doing great. Okay. So do I would need to give it a little bit of power when I'm... Nope, because we're cranking away at 75% power, right? Yeah. You'll lose a little bit of speed, won't you? Yeah. But so what? Yeah. We're All right, doing so do we want to do a whole 360 yep. here, or what do we do? We'll see how you do. You ready? Clear on the right. Okay, I've got the button held. You'll need a bit of rudder because I, you don't have the yaw damper anymore, do you? <laughs> Me, it's a little harder when I actually have to use the rudder. That's 30. 128.75, Red Lake 331. There you go. Take some back pressure, doesn't it? Yeah. So if you're low, roll out, pull up, and roll back in. Yeah. Not a lot. Don't jam the controls. Just smooth. Come on. Smooth. Up. Up and back in. And then hold it. Remember, as you bring the bank back in, the nose will naturally fall back down on its own. So watch. Okay. Here. Yeah. Roll in. And look what happens to the nose. It comes on. It doesn't need you. To lower the nose. Yeah. The increase in bank step, does it. Like right that, if I let go, you're gonna, the nose is gonna dump. Okay. So come on, do it. Out, roll out, pull up, pull up harder, harder, get back in, roll back in. Thank you. And we're doing my golf maintain 4,500. This traffic at your 12 o'clock and six miles eastbound, e 58 and then a twin Cessna five miles north of your position. None of my golf will maintain 4.5 or above. So right, we're gonna stay right here. Okay. Okay. So what I wanna do is somewhat let's do a 180 to your right. Clear on the right. Now, I'm gonna put the mixture rich and the boost pump on because we're gonna maneuver. So we're gonna do some unusual attitudes. I have the airplane. Oh, okay. So let's just say Altitude. Yeah, I know it, lady. So now, what would you do to recover? Build power, power. Level, level the wing. and out. Yep. Okay? Yep. Nice. Now keep going. Turn to the right. KLM 620, heavy, box on departure, right of contact, climb maintain, a 14000. Let the nose fall. Okay. KLM 620, heavy, just confirm you're leaving 2300. Okay, what would you do now? Bring power. power back. Go ahead. Yeah. Roll the wings level. Altitude. And lift the nose. Jen. Awesome. Really well. Okay. Okay. Power comes back. So now, I want you to get a little confidence. I have the airplane again. Okay. Okay. Altitude. So here's the airplane. The airplane's getting really slow, right? Yep. Really Friendly slow. Okay, watch. Thank Press the level button. Norwood, runway one one, let go. Three zero two eight. Airplane has it. Let it go. Does a pretty good job, doesn't it? Yeah, it really does. Okay, just wanted you to see that. Yep. Okay. Um, I have the airplane. Go ahead and put your foggles on. So now, put your head in your lap. Currently 4033 heading three, zero, zero. Okay, recover. Okay, level, level, oh. gently. All right. Okay, gently. Remember, if this happens while you're in the clouds, you can't be super aggressive on the plane, ever. Okay. Ever, okay? I have the airplane. 
Okay, I didn't understand. I didn't do the power right. You totally did it right. Where was the nose? Level, I tricked you. Yeah. Okay. I, I, would... I just gave you a super steep bank. Watch. Yeah. The airplane was here. Yeah. Right? Yeah. There's no need to do anything with the power. Uh, yeah. Right? So then, have to turn it. smoothly recover. Okay? Yep. yep. Alright. I have the airplane Can I again. look down again? Yep. Are you trying to trick me or something? What would I ever do that <laughs> to you? Altitude, altitude. Okay, your airplane. Evaluate. Power. Go, go, power. Good. Perfect okay. traffic, uh, 485 level crossing runway 6 and 4 at Kilo Plymouth. Gentle 180 left. I have the airplane again. Put your head in your lap. Web traffic. Uh, 45 Bravo clear. 6 and 4 kilo pull the traffic. And you are, we are clear, okay? So. You got another flight tonight, Will? Okay, uh, your airplane. Power, 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 wings level. Let the speed bring the nose up. Nice, okay. see? You don't have to pull the nose up, the speed of the airplane, because it's trimmed for level, isn't it? Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. It does? What am I trying to tell you? Trimmed for level flight. Yep, so what happens when the airplane is faster than level flight? What happens when it's faster than level flight? Yeah, if it's trimmed for level, what happens to the nose? Okay, watch. Gonna I'm going to show up. you. Yeah, exactly. So watch, I'm going to do this all on its own. If you look, I've got the ESP shut off, right? Yeah. I'm going to let the airspeed build like crazy. Yeah. The smooth night, I'm going to let the airspeed build, okay? Okay. So watch, if I roll the wings level, I make the vertical component of lift go, and where does the nose go? Up, ball, watch this. Yep. It's gonna go up all the way on its own, right? Yeah. I don't have to pull the stick back. Okay. The vert I just get vertical component of lift working for me, Yep. and it does it. Doesn't okay. that make sense? Yep. Okay, one more time, we're just gonna okay. go. Please do me a favor, look left, make sure there's no traffic. I don't, I've been looking on the screen. But Okay. And you don't have to. You don't have to have your foggles on now. I can take those. Put them in the back. So again, watch. So the air speeds. The nose is buried, right? 15 yeah. degrees. Altitude. Now level the wings. Easy, easy. Now let the airplane just fly. See what it does? You yeah. don't have to pull the nose up. Right, because it wants to do it on its it own. It wants to do it all on its own because it's trimmed that way. Okay, I see. Okay, does that make sense? Yep. Okay, so now if we have the nose here, point, bring the bank over, the airplane comes down all on its own. Yep. Roll the wings level. Okay, yep. make the airplane work for you. Does that make sense? Yep. So we're gonna do this one more time. So now, nose going up, we pitch the nose, right? Yep. So where do we want the vertical component of lift? Not going this way. So we just bank Altitude. the airplane. Yep. Let the Good nose now. come down gently. Get it to the horizon, roll wings level. And then we recover. Okay. Good? Yep. Awesome work. Nice. I like it, babe. Good job. Mixer flaps, lights and switches, we are landing. Okay, so I have your trim good. 
Roll it out. Come on, keep roll. Keep flying. Fly the nose. Forget what's inside. Fly yeah. the nose. Look yeah, outside. Yeah, but yeah, four, Minimums. Nine, zero, three Minimums. Okay, uh, Caps is now uh, unavailable. One, one five, four. Okay. So now you're a little fat, a little high, right? Yeah. So bring the power back a little. Just a hair. But 500. Perfect. No need to make a big change. Where's the wind again? One Doesn't seven. matter. There's no wind. It's like just from the left a little bit. Perfect. Still like a little high. high, right? You are. So bring the power back a little more. Bring the nose down just a hair. But you're by no means unstabilized. It's a good. It's a good set. Yeah, 80 right here. Right. Keep trimming now. Keep trimming. Trimming. Yeah, Blue Jetter System 4890 is a mile southwest, then a left cross one one five. Okay, okay you gotta help me here. No, I'm not helping you at all. <laughs> that was lucky. I know. <laughs> I'm not helping you, I'm not helping you. Whoa, 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 whoa. I touched it. Oh, oh my god, we're here. <laughs> Stay on the whoop settle line would be awesome. I'm trying. <laughs> Go to the next one, you're not gonna make this one. <laughs> Revive alive one more time. <laughs> That's all she wrote. So tonight was, I think, a pretty awesome flight. There wasn't really much to talk about. Karen's learning unusual attitude flying really pretty well. I think her medium bank turns were awesome. The beginning of the patterns were really good. Her slow flight was really good. And I think the steep turns just need some more work, that they're the hardest thing to do under the hood for sure. And I think the big takeaway on the lesson tonight is from the unusual attitudes and how to get the lift vector to work for us and you could see when the airplane's nose got high we just let the bank in a little bit let the nose come down a little and then level the wings and then when the airplane was really fast just level the wings and let the excess speed bring the nose up on its own and that helps us sort of protect from overloading or over g'ing the airplane uh, when it's going really fast like that hope you guys had some fun Leave some comments down below and we'll try to keep uh, making some cool content. Have a great one. Uh.